Hello everybody. Today we are going to see cutover activity in SAP implementation. Before that, let me introduce myself. I'm Swami here. I have 17 years of experience in SAP. So now we are going to see cutover activity in SAP implementation. So what is cutover activity? So let's see uh, ASAP accelerated SAP methodology. First. So first is project preparation phase. Second is blueprinting phase. Three third is realization phase. Fourth is final preparation and go live and support. So this cutover activity will be happening in the final preparation phase. So that is cutover activity. Final preparation phase. So what we have to do is all the business processes from the quality client will be transported to the production client. So business, what, do, what do you mean by the business processes? So for example, order to cash cycle is a business process, right? Sales order creation, delivery and billing is the business processes. Quotation, inquiry, quotation, sales order, that is order confirmation, delivery, billing is a business process. In SAP MM, request for uh, purchase requisition, request for quotation, quotation maintenance, vendor selection, purchase order creation, goods reserve, and invoice verification is a business process. All those business processes on the background will be configured in the golden box client. And from that golden box client, it will be transported to the quality client and from the quality client, it will be transported to the production client. So production client, during the transportation of all the requirements to the production client, production client will be, production server will be, they will shut, put up the production server. So, so that no activities will be happening in the production server. That is entry of data. No end user activity or the data entry will be happening in the production server during the transportation of requirement from the quality server to the production. So this transportation will be done by basis team, SAP basis team. So they are the one who, who do all the transportation of requirement. So apart from transportation of require, requirement, all the master data will be uploaded like material master, customer master, vendor master and GLNR, GLN account, general ledger account. So those are all master data, some of the master data. So these data will be uploaded through batch data conversion or LSMW concepts in SAP workbench. It's a LSMW is a legacy migration system workbench. BDC is beta, batch data conversion. So this uploading of data will be done through either or any of these concepts like LSMW or BDC. And transaction data will also be uploaded in the production server. Vendor balance, customer balance, open sales order, open purchase order, open delivery which is not being built. So all those transaction data will be uploaded to production client through BDC or LSMW. So stock updates like plant stock, material stock, cash in hand, petty cash. Everything will be scrapped. Everything will be updated in the production plan. So uploading will be done through LSMW, BDC or LDMC in S4 HANA business suite. So thank you.